Hey guys, good morning. Today is Wednesday, June 21st. And I think the time right now is almost eight in the morning. And like usual, I'm gonna get my regular workout and I forgot my lunch again. So yesterday I ordered Uber Eats. So today I've decided to change it up and try DoorDash. And I had pasta yesterday, so um, I figured I would try pizza and and there are a ton of pizza places in the area like Pizza Hut, Pizza Pizza. There are Italian restaurants too that has pizza, but those are too fancy for me. So my plan is to try a store that I haven't tried before, which is Papa John's. So let's get started. Okay, so this is the DoorDash customer app. As you can see, there are tons of buttons. And it says here, I can enjoy zero delivery fees for your first month on every order over $10. And it's also asking me to join Dash Pass and the breakfast. And yeah, there you go. And then there's like McDonald's, Subway, Tim Hortons. Um, Yinji Chanva, it's like a Asian portrait, Asian breakfast place kind of thing. All day breakfast. Wendy's, AW, Starbucks too. Mmm, yummy. Well, it's more, these are the restaurants in my area, so. Old Village Bistro is another breakfast place and Loveless, uh, I'll try another time. So, let me see if I can order from, oh, there's Symposium too. Hmm, are they open now? Let's see. Okay, so I have to click on here, the distance, and that's how you can see they're open. They're open right now. Okay, if Papa John is not open, then I will probably order Symposium and see, because this is breakfast place too. Okay, so let's go search for Papa John's. Okay, it says here it's closed. It delivers by 1040. So that works well for me. So let's go down. I'm going to order. Okay, there's some popular items. Cheese steaks, Hawaiian pizza, pepperoni pizza, stuffed crust. Uh, maybe another day. Uh, I need to really... Yeah, I don't want to eat too much. The meat pizza, chicken poppers. I'm fat, by the way. Stuffed crust, and then all these kinds of pizzas. So I think today I'm just gonna try to order. I think I think I'm just gonna order pepperoni. There you go. Okay, so I'm gonna just do the uh, 10 inch, 12 inch, 14 inch, 16. I'm just gonna do 10 because I'm eating by myself here. And size and apps. Yeah, I don't need all this. Oreo cookies pop up bites. Uh, no, I don't. I think I'm good with these. Desserts, maybe another time. I don't really like pizza stores desserts. I don't know. I'd rather actually go to a restaurant or a dessert place to have desserts. I don't know. I feel like they are pre packaged and they're not fresh. So I'm not gonna get desserts. And beverages, ginger ale, Pepsi, Dr. Pepper, Pepsi, Bad Pepsi, Mountain Dew. Um, I don't like any of this. So let me just go to add to order. And let's see if they have any drinks. So, so drinks. So they have root beer, Dr. Pepper, Mountain Dew, Bad Pepsi. Oh, oh, wow. Mmm. Brisk tea. Mm. Wow. Okay. So, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to try this one. The brisk tea. Have you tried this before? Comment down below. Yeah, I haven't tried it before. I think it's just iced tea, right? So, let me just add, add to order. Okay, fuel carts. Papa John's pizza, pepperoni pizza, and that's it. Okay, and... Oh, actually saved three bucks with promotions. Nice! Okay, so yeah, that's the promotion right here. It's uh, I think it's zero dollar delivery fee for orders over 10 So I don't have to pay any delivery fee and that's it fees and estimated tax So here's the service fee a dollar ninety nine this 11 percent service fee helps us operate DoorDash and Estimated tax is two dollars and eleven cents. Okay. Okay, and it says scheduled delivery and yes I'm gonna set my delivery time to 10 30 to 10 50. That's perfect. Add a tip I'm gonna do zero, huh? I'm gonna put zero dollar tip and see how fresh my pizza is gonna be. This will be very interesting to see. Okay, let's place order. See, schedule delivery for today, 10.30 to 10.50. Let's see when my pizza will arrive. Place order. 
Okay, there it is, guys. It says my order is scheduled. It's scheduled for 10 40. Let's see if it's gonna be on time or it's gonna be late. I will be back. Hey, guys, right now the time is 10 15 a.m. And look, my order is heading my way. And I actually got a notification at 10 saying Papa Joss has picked up my order. And about eight minutes later, I got this notification saying Doordash has assigned a dasher. And I think in five minutes he arrived. And now he's coming! Look, I'm trying to cover the dasher's name. Hold on, let me see if I can do that. Here, you see the map? And it says it will arrive between 1022 to 1025 in five minutes. And I think the red is his car and where I am is the black. Oh my God, and I didn't even tip. And actually there are two Papa John's in my area and I thought they were assigned to a Papa John's that are in the main road, but they assigned it to the one on the north in the north. So, oh, he's coming. The Dasher took a picture of my order and he tells me I'm coming now. Oh my God, he gave me such good service and I didn't tip him. Oh my goodness. Yeah, he's gonna arrive anytime soon. That's crazy. Maybe because it's a weekday and nobody orders in the morning and he's trying to make money. I don't know. Oh my God. Or maybe he's a top dasher. I don't know. He's trying to just take whatever. I guess the DoorDash program is really helping in getting drivers to take no tip orders. They really do. This is just crazy. Oh my God. I I don't know what to say. I know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, oh my god. I was hoping my pizza will be very cold and hard, but I think it's a weekday. I think um, ordering on a weekday when it's not busy, drivers will take whatever. Whatever makes sense. I mean, from this Papa John's to where I am right now, I think it's like about five kilometers. So I guess DoorDash is paying him like six bucks to do this order so six bucks for six kilometers because if you because if your acceptance rate is like over 50 percent once you get to that point um you you wouldn't get that many um four dollar no tip orders like those no tips are gonna be like five dollars six dollars or even eight dollars sometimes depending on the distance and stuff so yeah i believe this guy is a top dasher or he's trying to or I don't know, it's just dead right now and he's trying to make money. I'm sure this order is gonna be six dollars for him or five bucks. I don't know. Oh, I think my experiment failed. Damn it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, he's getting closer now. I hope you guys can see it. Look, he's getting closer now. Oh. I don't know what the flash is. It says it's gonna be arrived between 1023 to 1026, and now the time is 1020. That's just crazy! Oh my god. Oh arriving now. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys again. The picture and the text. That's just crazy. I don't know if you guys can see it. I think the glare kinda disturbed it a little bit, but yeah. So I guess sometimes white people don't tip because they don't have to. The food just come on time. Doesn't matter. But maybe during lunchtime, if you order during lunchtime, it will matter. But right now it's a weekday in the morning when nobody orders. Drivers will take whatever. Yeah, he's still finding his way. Oh my God, look at that. And yeah, I think uh, the big difference between DoorDash and Uber is for DoorDash, I don't know the driver's car, but on Uber, um, Uber will let you know the driver's car, so um, like there's no way of knowing where my dasher is, where my delivery driver is. That's the main difference. There's no map showing the driver going to the restaurant. It's only from the restaurant to the drop-off. That's the difference. Where is this guy? It says arriving now and he was stopping. I think I should go out and uh, wait for him. I'll be back. Hey guys, I got the food right here and the drink here too. So he just gave me, he just gave the food to me like this, basically. And uh, yeah, he was so nice. He's like, there you go. And I'm like, oh, thank you. I was like, that. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Okay, um, let's open the box, shall we? Yeah, it smells not bad actually. <laughs> oh my God, oh shit. 
I should order on a weekend. We'll see what happens. Oh god. Okay. All right. So. Oh, I didn't order dip. Oh my god, it gave me pepper too. Look. So here's the pizza. This is look nice. And garlic sauce. I didn't order any sauce. Why did it give me sauce? Anyways, I I don't usually dip it, but I think. I think I'll dip it this time. I don't know. And a little pepper here. I don't know what they're for, but it smells good though from looking at it. But uh, there's no napkins or anything, so that's the bad part. I don't think Papa John skip napkins for pizza orders. I've never seen a pizza place skip napkins, so I don't think not giving napkins for pizza place is not my. You know what I mean? Like it, it's it's okay not to give napkins for pizza places. I don't know how to say it. I don't know, brain fart. Okay, so shall we give it a try? Okay, let me grab a small piece. Oh my God, this is huge for one person. Oh, look at that. Look at that pepperoni. Mmm. It's actually not for hot. It's hot, but not piping hot. I think it's better than pasta. I didn't tip anything. And better quality food than tipping. That's crazy. But I ordered for Uber though, so that could be made a difference. Mm. Maybe I'll try the sauce too. I don't really dip sauces, but I'll try it. Mm. Mm. It's good. Like the crust is so crunchy too. I should have a mic. You know how people like eat it with the mic and then you can capture the crunch, the noise of the crunch. Maybe you should buy a mic. I don't know. We'll see how popular this kind of video goes. I mean, if nobody watches it, what's the point? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, now so I'm gonna try with the garlic sauce. Let's see how it tastes. So let me open it. Oh, it's um kind of yellow out inside. It's not that thick either. A little bit thick, but not. It's gonna spill if I tilt it a little bit more. Um, yeah, let's just give it a try. If it doesn't taste good, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna dip it again. I'm just gonna dip it once. So you know what? I'm gonna try to grab a little piece of the crust here and uh, let me just try to dip it with a little crust or like that and then we'll see how the garlic sauce tastes. Mmm. I don't like the garlic sauce. I don't like it. I want the sauce. It's too artificial for me. I'm gonna leave it aside. No sauce for me. I don't know why they put include garlic sauce though. You know what? Now let's try with the little pepper here. I think it's spicy. I don't know. So it's gonna eat like this. Let's see. Oh yeah. But it's not bad. It tastes really good. I'm not a spice person. But I think um, it helps in, you know, get the creamiest, I mean, get the creamiest feeling out from the pizza. The spice helps. So, but ah, it's too spicy. I'm gonna leave it too. It's gonna continue eating this. Mm. <sighs> this experiment is a fail. <laughs> Maybe I'll try order on a weekend and see if it's gonna affect anything. Cause sometimes I find some Papa John's pizza are sitting on the on top of the pizza oven. So if they've been sitting in the pizza oven for a while, it definitely would affect the, the quality of the pizza. But this time, the dash was actually waiting inside, so obviously it's gonna be fresh. <sighs> okay, let me finish this piece and then I'm gonna try the brisk. I haven't tried the brisk before. Hey guys, brisk is open. Let's try. Oh, it's not sweet at all. I think it's less sweet from Nest Tea. I like it actually. 
Mm. Oh, it's really good. I like this. So if you don't want water and you want a less sweet alternative, Brisk is your drink. Mm. Okay, so let me try to eat this once more like this. I think what I meant to say is it, the spice catch out the richness of the pizza because some people would find it very rich because of the cheese and starch and stuff. And uh, the pepper definitely helps in cutting it. Mmm, yeah. Oh, I had a big bite on the pepper here. Mmm. <laughs> Mmm. 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 So I'm gonna try to finish this pizza here. So that's it for today, guys. If you like this video, please click the subscribe button, smash the like button, leave comments, ask questions. I will always answer them. I never miss anyone actually. And if you enjoy what I'm doing, subscribe too. And I'll see you next time. Bye guys. Mmm. Oh, finally, I finished my pizza. I am so full. Oh, it's so hot outside, and I'm full. Oh.